Hey you guys, it's Fluffy Girl Jess. So I am gonna come at you today with a, a little video. Hopefully I'm, I'm gonna try not to make it too long. It is a little monster doll update. So it's these little cuties that were in my pocket doll uh, first video. I've fallen in love with these little girls. They're eight inches tall. They're adorable. I have since acquired um, the last two of the five that I have seen available on Amazon. I did get this little girl and this little girl. They're so cute. This one's little sassy, salty face just cracks me up. Um, it, she's just a mood. And then this little girl, she's just adorable. I love her. She, oh, I love them all, but they're just so cute. So, so cute. And they're so flexible. And anyway, so I've had a couple of people ask questions on where to find shoes and clothes. And I have done some trial and error on some stuff just by, you know, having them for a little while and trying to find them clothes. Um, so this is a little update video of what works and what doesn't. And hopefully I don't ramble too bad. So I have some little outfits here, right here, this little pirate over little pirate short alls right here. Um, not the t-shirt, but just the short alls are from Brown Daisy Designs on Etsy. Um, they are actually, um, for the American Girl Caring for Baby stuff. Some of the American Girl Caring for Baby clothes works and some doesn't. So keep that in mind. The American Girl Caring for Baby is a little chonkier than, um, the Monst doll bodies. Um, so just keep that in mind. So if you don't mind an oversized look, then just, like I said, go for it. But um, the little short alls from Brown Daisy Designs are adorable. Um, all of her stuff is adorable. And then this little girl right here is also wearing an American Girl Caring for Babies outfit. It's just a little strawberry romper that came with the head bow. This I got quite a while ago for, actually for my American Girl Caring for Baby. Um, and I was like, hmm, I wonder if she can wear it. And they can. Now, um, <laughs> the this little outfit came from Sew and Bow Co. On, um, also on Etsy. Now, the little um, straps right here in the back, I have some of it tucked in right here. The, this is all elastic around her waist. I have it tucked in a little bit because the straps on that little romper are slightly too long, but I didn't want to tailor the romper um, just in case I wanted to ever use it for my caring for baby um, American Girl teeny doll again. Um, but if I just tuck them in, it's, it's fine. It stays. So um, this little t-shirt I got also from Etsy, and this is from Clearwater Crafts, I believe, on Etsy. This little t-shirt um, does run a little big on the uh, Monst Girls, but it looks so flippin' cute. Um, the surprising outfits that I have found that work um, in my last, um, pocket doll video where I did my Kathy Cruz Cruzling review. Um, remember this little outfit that I didn't review? Well, I opened it and I was like, hmm, I wonder if it works. Sure does. Sure does. The little t-shirt and the overalls, they both work and it looks so adorable on them. I will insert a picture of one of them wearing it right here. Boop. Okay, now back to the wardrobe. <laughs> so um, if you have any Helen Kish Riley dolls, those actually will work. Um, those little outfits work. This little dress right here is a um, Helen Kish Riley doll dress. This is actually a, she's from a, a limited edition, um, I think that was the I one of the IDEX dolls, the International Doll and Bear Expo or something like that. 
I've had them for a while, you guys. And um, the the actual owner of said dress is upstairs um, with her buddies. So, um, but these little these little outfits will actually work. So any Helen Kish Riley doll clothes will work. But the shoes for Helen Kish Riley dolls also work. So, um, and then I have, I had already made some outfits for my Helen Kish Riley dolls and this little ducky romper is one of them that I made. Um, and she's so cute. Um, and that works. So if you can find any, I know, uh, listen, I'm just going to say Etsy. Etsy has so many options. They have ready-made clothes. They have PDF patterns. I've never done a PDF pattern on Etsy because I just haven't. So um, I, I'm more of a I'm more of a ready-made person <laughs> on Etsy. So, um, but those work now. The for the shoes, I have these little brown shoes that fit my Lottie Yellow um, BJD doll. These little itty bitty tiny uh, little brown Mary Jane shoes. Those fit the girls also. Um, and they're super adorable. Now I have found a, um, a shop. I'm sorry, I got sidetracked. Um, I have found a shop on also on Etsy that sells doll shoes that are under one inch. So if that's what, um, if you're looking for shoes, just um, type in um, doll shoes that are under an inch. And then these little sneakers, they're tiny, but they also work. They're, whoop, I dropped it. Um, these are kind of a struggle to get on their teeny tiny feet but uh it works now if you want some that is not a struggle you can get these shoes hold on we'll go with these little red sneakers and these little red sneakers so here's these tiny red sneakers right here these will require some some work to get on these red. sneakers i got off of etsy there are, they are big. So, so here is the tiny red sneaker and here is the big red sneaker and they're ooh, heel to heel. So they are a tiny bit bigger, but these are not as hard to get on and off. Um, like I said, I found these on Amazon. They do not have, well, they do come with ties, but not ones that you can adjust. Um, so I just, I, yanked those out and put in ribbons so I can snuggie them up on their little feet a little bit better. Um, and they will not fall off. This little girl right here travels in my backpack most days and she's usually wearing sneakers and um, they won't come off. They won't come off. I don't want to give her uh shaken baby syndrome. Um, so, um, anyway, those work. And then I, they, um, those little, these little tennis shoes, did I say they came off on Amazon? Did I say, I don't remember where it was, you guys. Okay, these little sneakers right here, I got on Amazon and they come in a six pack or a 12 pack. I got the six pack because I didn't, I, I, did, I wasn't quite sure if they would work or not. So I didn't want to, I didn't want to be in it for, that many sneakers if and if you know if they didn't work but they do work so yep these little sneakers keep in mind will work and they're on amazon and um like i said they're a little big for their feet but they work um <coughs> excuse me and um it helps them stand up on their own a little bit better they're a little more stable on their little feet um so yeah she's got on little sneakers she's got on little sneakers <laughs> she's got on little sneakers. Uh, what does that say? I'm, I'm definitely a casual person. So if it's uh, jeans and sneakers or, uh, you know, little t-shirts, then I'm all for it. Or little 
little overalls or short alls or whatever. They're just super cute. And then, um, like I said, the Cruiselings um, outfits work. What else did I find that works? The Lori dolls. The Lori dolls outfits. That is trial and error. So, the, you know, the little tiny six inch um, dolls that, um, that are at Target. Um, they're also on Amazon. They have all kinds of accessory packs and what have you. Um, some of those actually work. Um, I had a little dress on one of them and a jacket and it worked. So, um, if the dress is more of a straight dress, like a, like a sheath dress, it won't work. If it's more of like a pleated dress or just a fuller skirted dress, it will work. Now, they're a little bit shorter because you're going from the Lori dolls, which are six inch, to the Mott's dolls, which are eight inch, um, but it still looks super adorable. So, um, just bear in mind um, that if you do have any Lori girl clothes, if it is stretchy or um, not as fitted of a style, I guess, then it will most likely work. I'm not gonna say it will work, but it will most likely work. Now, the Lori doll shoes are a no-go. Um, they are too wide for their feet, and they're also a teeny bit too long for their feet, and they won't, they just won't stay on. I've tried a pair of ballerina flats, I've tried a pair of little boots, and it's just, it's just, Sorry, that was the dog water. <laughs> Sorry. Um, uh, but it's just a no-go for the Lori doll shoes. But um, I've also found some little shoes for them on Amazon, but it's slim pickings. Your best bet is um, Etsy. And I will I will put in the, um, the shop name for the little doll shoes that I have found on Etsy that work. And just remember to go to the under one inch doll shoes because they also have caring for baby shoes. And I'm, I don't have any shoes for my caring for baby girl. Um, so I'm, I'm not a hundred percent if those would work or not. So if you do have, um, any American girl caring for baby shoes and you have a monster doll, Try it on and let us all know because I, I I don't know and I want to know. So, but um, just make sure you go to the little drop down that says doll shoes under one inch. So, there's that. Um, what else works? The Lori doll. Yeah, the Lori doll stuff. That was actually really surprising. So, like I said, that was pretty trial and error. Um, the Lori doll pants, I had a little pair of little red plaid pants and those are, they work, but they're, they're tight. Um, uh, the girls need to, you know, suck it in, um, when they're wearing those and, um, huh, she can't sit down in them. Um, she can move her little knees, but, uh, when you, when you sit her down, it, it says in the back with the Velcro. So, mm. so, um, and those, but those weren't stretchy at all. Those were just fabric. Um, so I'm, I'm pretty sure that if they were stretchy pants, like leggings or, um, little, little like jeggings, that those would work. They would just be like ankle pants. They wouldn't be like full pant pants. But if you put little high tops on them, nobody would know. Just saying. Um, and besides, ankle pants are trendy. Um, so, I hope this helps. Um, I hope I haven't rambled too long. I'm gonna edit this a little bit for content because I know that I've yapped yapped. So, um, anyway, I hope this helps. Um, I hope you guys find some really cool stuff. 
Um, if you have found stuff that works um, that I didn't know about or that, you know, that you've done that's like trial and error and like, hey, this works, let us know. That would be freaking awesome. Um, yeah, I'm always, I'm always looking for outfits for these little cuties. Um, so, yeah. Uh, but thank you so much, you guys, for listening to me. Uh, yeah, I've gone about these little dolls again. And um, uh, I will see you guys later. Uh, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And I will, I will talk at you guys later. Because I have, like I said, I have some more pocket doll dollies to share with you guys. And I have some more like ruby red outfit reviews to do for you guys and so on and so forth so hopefully soon yeah bye guys